Right, so I've got Saturn and, and it's, um, sorry, Jupiter and it's uh, four moons. We've got two on the right, close together. We've got one very close on the left and one much further out on the left. So here we are. This is Jupiter. So you've got that on your little camera now. Yep, and now I'm going to rotate my camera. I'll show you again in a minute. Rotating my camera. Round we go, trying to keep it lined up there. And we can see that Jupiter and its moons all shifted. have all shifted and rotated. And uh, if I come around much more, if I don't lose it, I just about get them vertical. Anyway, no, losing it there. This is a very unscientific way of doing it. <laughs> Bringing it back around point. again, but it proves the point mm. that the orientation of the planet depends on the orientation of the camera and the telescope yeah. and the mount and your viewing location, your latitude <laughs> and the position of the planet in the sky what time of the year here we go